Hey tech enthusiasts, have you ever wondered if your smartphone is smarter than you? Or if those constant updates are secretly just elaborate plans for digital world domination? Well, grab your tinfoil hats because it's time to dive into the rabbit hole of the latest tech news. I promise to keep it less conspiracy and more hilarity. Let the tech talk commence. First up, picture this. You're lounging in your living room humming to Pink Floyd, and suddenly your walls come to life, intertwining art and science right before your eyes. Yep, that's Brainstorms, a great gig in the sky, a live interactive experience that'll have you question the boundaries of reality. And if you're brave enough, you can pay to become part of the exhibition. Talk about immersion overload. Moving on to a heroic stock trading tale, Kevin Shu turned a comfy sum of $35,000 into a staggering $8 million. Trading stocks from 2020 to 2022 earned him the nickname Sir Jack a lot on Reddit. It looks like the stock market is the new Excalibur, and Kevin is our modern-day knight in shining armor. Let's get a bit brainier, shall we? Open Source Initiative is dabbling deep into the discussion of open source AI. Meanwhile, the open AI rival Anthropic released Claude 3.5 Sonnet, a not-too-shabby upgrade that still can't pen sonnets like Shakespeare. Oh, and OpenAI is putting big bucks into its enterprise sales and tech organizations, because AI needs a paycheck too, apparently. Now for a dash of less than pleasant news. A hacker is auctioning off customer data from an Australia-based ticketing company. Gather round, fellow netizens. It sounds like the perfect time to update those passwords you've been recycling since the dawn of the internet. And here's something to chat about. Dot is the latest AI companion that's hungry for your deepest, darkest thoughts. Is it just me? Or does it sound more like a digital diary with an appetite for gossip? Speaking of AI, in the kingdom of technology, Artificial intelligence is taking the throne, and Microsoft wants to hail its incoming reign. They're pushing Windows 11 and AI like a royal decree, possibly leading many PCs to the tech graveyard. It's like, to the recycling bin with the old guard. Amidst updates and upgrades, AI's got a bone to pick with local news. Partisan-funded websites are outpacing small newspaper sites. Talk about a plot twist in the reporting realm. Ever heard of a laptop that could connect to Wi-Fi all by itself? For better or worse, Google's rolling out AI-integrated Chromebooks, and Sony is just about releasing two games for the PSVR 2. My guess is they're playing hard to get. And folks, TikTok's becoming part of the political landscape as much as any high school prom court. With a general election looming in the UK, they're serving up journalist videos and fake news fighting tips like a Gordon Ramsay cooking class. Now, from the high seas to the cloud, we've set sail on Microsoft's ship as they endeavor to spice up the PC market with some AI seasoning and a Windows 11 pie. But will this feast end with a toast to success, or PCs being tossed faster than bad fruitcake after the holidays? Stay tuned. And in a stunning turn of events, Apple wants to redefine AI to stand for Apple intelligence. Because when you can't join them, just create your own definition, right? Their version might not have a bag of cool tricks just yet, but it's acing the integration exam, so there's that. In the world of mental health, social media apps may be headed for the warning track. It's like putting up a sign next. Caution, deep rabbit holes ahead. Finally, let's talk cyber protection because nobody wants to be that guy who clicked the link in the phishing email and brought down the entire network. Bringing it home, all this tech talk begs the question, are we steering the ship or is AI about to make us walk the plank? Now don't forget to like, hit that subscribe button and ring the bell icon so you won't miss any of our future tech voyages. Until next time, keep those updates coming and stay clever, my friends.